Hello everybody, today we're going to uh, go over how to change these pain in the butt gas spouts to the more standard old school style uh, that have the little bent plug and uh, you just have the cap that you take off and you pour in. These are great in theory, but in, in practical application they're a big pain in the butt um, trying to get you know the, the three different motions to open it up and to actually pour stuff out and then it pours real slow. So. Uh, I got this product off of Amazon, it's Rover Aid. And if we open it up, you can see there's just a bunch of different parts and pieces, uh, a couple different caps, uh, depending on the size that you have, along with the spouts. And then it has the vent caps in the back here. So I'm gonna open this up, lay out the parts and pieces, and we'll go ahead and get started. All right, we have parts and pieces laid out. Um, you have two different size uh, caps, the spouts. These, ones here are for if your can already has like the little uh little vent hole on it it's a replacement cap uh, i don't particularly need these these are the retrofit vent caps these things are like these little lanyards and i couldn't find a spot really to put them so uh, i'm not going to worry about those it just it arches over and then that end goes into that end forms the circle so um I, like i said i just couldn't find a good spot online so the, I went ahead and did this can already just to kind of work through the process and uh, make sure I had everything right. Um, so I added the vent cap on there, added the spout, and replaced all that. So we're going to walk through doing it on this can, and I'll show you the steps and the processes that we took. Um, Tool-wise, we used a drill with a half-inch drill bit. Uh, I had some snips, rubber mallet, and a uh, utility knife just to clean up the hole after we drill one. Uh, so first step here is we're going to take this spout off and then after I get this spout off I'm going to put it directly into the trash can. This is where the snips come in um, to get this this uh, ring off um, I just took a pair of snips cut it off and put directly in trash can. Uh, so with the two different vent caps I'm just going to grab one so that one works good Uh, but this one feels like it works a little bit better. So we're going to use that one. Um, you just take your vent, or your spout rather, put it through. It does have a screen in there, which is kind of nice. And we'll screw that one on. It's nice and snug. And so the next thing is we need to add a vent cap. So if we look, when we fill this all the way up, it's right here. So you don't want to place your vent cap below that. And so I'm going to put mine, I think, right here on top. Um, the other one I put in the handle, uh, it, it'll it work, but I didn't really like how it turned out. So I'm going to go ahead and put it on top. First, I'm going to grab a rag and kind of wipe that off to make sure that we don't um, put any dirt and stuff inside the gas can. All right, we got that cleaned up. So using the drill, we'll just pop a hole in. All right, then we're going to brush away from the hole to try to keep that plastic out of the gas can as much as you can. Uh, and then use your you use the utility knife and you can kind of go around and again try to try to pull it so it doesn't go into the trash can or into the gas can itself. But we're just cleaning up the hole. Okay, so with the hole in. We just need to put that cap in. So this is the cap that'll pop in right here. But first, we're gonna go ahead and close it. We're gonna place it kinda in there as much as we can. Then we're gonna grab a rubber mallet. And with the rubber mallet, we'll give it a good whack. And that put it in. Looks nice and tight. And now we have our vent in there. And that, my friends, is the uh, the easy easy way to do this. So, vent cap in, spout on, and we're good to go. Don't have to mess with those uh, the, those safety or the the ventless ones. I don't, I don't know how they all work. Um, now the cap up here it is screw on, which is that part is kind of nice. So you, you can just screw it back on, and it'll stay in place. So you don't have to keep taking it on and off. 
Um, so that is how we install and replace a, uh, a vent uh, gas can spout um, with one of the easier ones, the old school version. Um, if you have any questions, comments, concerns, please leave those in the comments below. Hit like, subscribe, and we will see you later.